The first league championship of the year is in the books. Fort Lormy wins the Shelby County League crown. Anna took home the tournament title. More league golf tournaments next week across the area. And five more great plays from Zach Keith in this week's Layfeld Welding Top 5 Plays. Corey Rawson kicking this week's top five off. They had total control over Arcadia in the BBC opener. Hornets first play out of the half. The Blaine train, Blaine Peterson, sees only green grass on his way to the end zone. He had two touchdowns, 237 rushing yards on just 19 carries. The Fighting Hornets get their first win, 61-0. Another long run as we head down the road to Waynesfield Goshen. It's Joel Rickle breaking free for the long touchdown against Ridgedale. Tigers in the win column as they get the victory 46 to 14. Head to Ottawa Glandor for our three spot. It's Bass Kobe Burchette who's been dealing with bad snaps. Loses this one but gets it back and picks it up while avoiding the snack fun. Avoiding the sack fun, Sean Beverly who takes it in the end zone. What a wildcat touchdown as they take the early lead. At the two spot, it's Arlington looking to put some points on the board before the half. The quarterback, Jacob Russell, finds Ivan Barry. Good job by Barry to get open and then he's shoved out of bounds. Gets his foot down, crucial first down. Let's look at our slow motion Lynchton replay. Nice job, he actually got both down, so that's a good catch in the NFL and then gets lots of support. Finally, the top spot is from Mac Country. St. Henry's Parker Link picking this pass off, takes it up the sideline, taken down at the goal line, but that's a pick six. How about the Redskins? 3-0 to start the season and a great end to our Layfeld Welding top five plays.